Good morning, friends, and welcome to Vlogmas Day 28. It is about six in the morning. I have actually been up for a while. Hold on, I just need to grab my phone. <laughs> but first I have to figure out where I put it. I'm actually going to be working out in my garage. I <clears throat> bought the set of TRX bands because I'm trying to like differentiate my strength training. I've gotten a personal trainer and I will tell you more about it once I am settled into the program, but they have me doing a TRX workout. This is such a good investment as far as like a piece of gym equipment for body strength. I do it in the garage just because this door is just like super sturdy. It makes me feel safer. And when I'm in the garage, the door opens this way. So you kind of want to go in the opposite direction and none of my other doors in the house work that way. So I'm going to get this set up. All you do is slide this. I'll show you. All you do to set this up is you slide that in the door just like that. That is really it. And then it is good to go. All right, I'm going to get my workout done so it's done for the day. All right, friends. So I am all cleaned up. I am meeting a friend for lunch at 1130, but right now I have errands I need to run because I don't want to run them tomorrow when it's going to get super busy. So I have to get to the grocery store, buy a couple things for New Year's Eve, um, and a couple groceries for like the next week, but just going to go run errands. I'll share whatever I end up grabbing. Um, yeah, here we go. Going attempt to leave them alone and they can watch Real Housewives of New York. Be good. No misbehaving. They both just went potty. We should be set. I am home. My friend is going to be a little bit early. So, everyone do business and be good doggies. <laughs> she runs right into him. Everyone do your business. We have things to do people to see. We have things to do people to see. All right, let's go to business. Someone had a little bit of anxiety while I was gone. <laughs> we just have like destroyed things everywhere. What I'm happy is though she did not touch my Ugg slippers, which is a blessing, but there is just like a massacre. Well, the office looks pretty good. Some I mean, I have had to embrace not having a perfectly clean house all the time. It's just not in my cards with the two dogs. All right, you guys are always asking what I buy. So tonight I'm just gonna do burgers, turkey burgers and fries. And then for New Year's Day, I'm gonna do a pork loin and sauerkraut. I just needed to like stock up on some cheeses. I am going to make Macaroni and cheese is one of our sides for our Birds and Bubbles New Year's Eve feast. I got some cucumbers, some basil, a salad. I love this already grilled chicken. I got some hard boiled eggs. And then some tomatoes and butter. And then, what else did I get from Trader Joe's? Also from Trader Joe's, I got some sourdough bread, some large eggs, some potatoes, and that's all from Trader Joe's. Oh wait, no, I also bought this baguette. For some reason, I wasn't thinking, and I was like, oh, I'll do like a bruschetta. But that won't go with what I'm making, so we might just have that like New Year's Day as like a little snack. I got buns for tonight. I got some pepperoni to make some homemade pizzas. Some turkey. Some ground turkey for the burgers tonight. Some ranch seasoning for the burgers tonight. 
some extra crackers. I got a cannoli dip for dessert on New Year's Eve. Got some cannoli chips to go with our cannoli dip. I swung by the dairy and got a fresh milk. I got some heavy cream. I thought these would be fun with the... So I'm thinking fried chicken, mac and cheese, mashed potatoes, and these biscuits. Then I got sauerkraut for the pork loin on New Year's Day. I got a block of charm parm cheddar cheese for the cheese board. Then I ran to Target and I got some party hats for the dogs and us. I really loved these plates. And napkins, I thought they were perfect for New Year's Eve. Then my cheese board utensils, I noticed at Christmas they were looking a little rough. So they had this marble set and I thought also with the gold, those actually worked really nice together. So I picked those up. I bought a streamer. I bought toothpaste, deodorant, happy new year banner, batteries. See, isn't this enthralling content? I bought some pizza crust because I don't feel like I'm gonna be cooking this weekend, so I don't feel like making pizza uh, pizza crust necessarily. I got some hot sauce, some pizza sauce. I got maple, some peanut butter, and then walking through Target, I have been looking to find this picture from Studio McGee, and mine had it in stock, so I hurried up and I grabbed it. And then for the bubble part of our birds, I got a bottle of Vu, and then I got a bunch of different samplings of different champagnes. I got some wet. La Marca is one of my favorite Proseccos, and I got that. Now, clearly, we will not drink all of this, but I just thought, like, would be fun to also, like, use as decor. And one of my favorite things, and they're not easy to find are these metal moe um, valves that you just, like spouts that you just stick in the bottle. So I have those for the evening as well. All right, I'm gonna get this all put away before my friend arrives and we head off for lunch because I haven't eaten a single thing yet today. We ended up spending so much time together till like two, it's now 2.50 and I'm just trying to get errands done. I just had to run some returns of some things that came today that I didn't like, but there were some things that I did like. These are my New Year's Eve pajama pants. How cool are these? I was like, when else could you ever wear sequined pajama pants? Um, I don't think they're necessarily pajama pants. I think some people would wear them out, but I'm wearing them for New Year's Eve. These are my New Year's Eve pants. Some things came for, this doesn't look like much, but I have a vision for what these will look like, and I actually have five more to pick up at my local party city. Um, I'm just waiting for them to confirm that they have them ready. And then the other thing that came was, this was one of Mabel's toys that we ordered and it got back ordered from Target. It has a little treat holder and it's like a puzzle ball. And then I got my hands these are selling out, men's and women's are selling out everywhere. These are the ultra low Uggs, super cute. Bought these, I wanna treat them before I wear them. I have like a suede protector that I buy from Clark's, but I want to protect those, but really excited about those. They're just very hard to get a hold of. I wanna get these boxes taken care of, get that trash taken care of, and then we can figure out what's next. While I am just trying to get some things tidied up and put away, I put my new orange picture behind the stove. I love how it looks. I like how it fills the space a little bit more. Just like it's so beautiful. But I love that part of my kitchen. And then with the flower one that I took down, I just hung it in the coffee bar. Ignore the mess. And what I use to hang, you guys always ask, it's a breeze to work with, is my favorite thing to work with, and I will leave it linked below. It's this clear adhesive, peels right off, holds anything. 
Highly recommend. I missed you so much. The whole five minutes I was away, I was like, how are we going to live without each other? I'm here. I've been gone five minutes. Five minutes. Yes, I missed you more. I can't. <laughs> um, so I just went to Party City. They had my final pieces that I need for my holiday garland. You all know that I love a garland and really like making the fireplace a statement piece. So I wanted to do something fun for New Year's. So I have these disco balls and I realize that they are just like way too small. So I am going to go ahead and get all the strings cut off of all of these and we're gonna, we're gonna play around a little bit. <gasps> Sound good? Sound good? Oh, I miss you so much. All right, let me get all my things prepped and then we'll catch up. I'm thinking I might need another one of the f four inch ones. I don't know, I have to play with them first. I switched out my books to just two black books because I know they'll go much better. And I'm putting down some of that adhesive that I just told you about is like one of my favorite things. And this will hold it. So look, okay, that is held in place. So now what I wanna kind of do is think about, I think I want one there, and then kind of fill in the space and start playing with it that way. So I'm gonna cut another piece of that adhesive and start adhering some. Let me build up this section, but I'm literally just gonna cut little pieces and I have this like half inch wide, and then I have a half inch wide. So I'm just going to play with both and see what ends up working for me. I'm finding that I don't have to secure every single one as like, as long as like larger ones are anchored. So this is like what I'm going for, like the spilling. And like, I want that to like cascade the whole way down this side. I hope I have enough. I might not, but we'll get as far as we can. I'm gonna keep anchoring these, but I'm literally just cutting, depending on the size, a piece of this and sticking it to the mantle or to like the next ornament. It's that easy. I am obsessed with how this turned out. So I kept it like kind of tight and like clustered. And then as I went, I wanted to like, almost like they were rolling away and have like this one by itself. And I just think it looks so, Cool. I love it. There is some stuff that's going to go up here. I'm just waiting for it to get delivered. But, I mean, it's so neat. I'm in love with it. This is a really great idea, though. Um, I just kind of was thinking about, like, how could I arrange them? But, like, yeah, that adhesive will pull right up. And then this is all set up. And I can use these year after year. I love it. I am getting so sore from my workout and I have to get dinner going and all the things. So I'm going to sign off day 28, 28. Like I do all of them, take care of yourself, take care of others, be kind, kindness is free, give it to everyone until next time, which will be tomorrow. And we're going to draw the winner for the tea advent calendar and we're gonna get that in the mail. And I have some other things planned for tomorrow, but I'll see you tomorrow, bye-bye. <laughs>